Hey, what's going on everyone? It's B. Avery here for another trailer reaction. Actually, this is not a trailer reaction. I'm just used to saying that. This is a reaction to a death battle video, Thanos vs. Darkseid. Uh, you're probably saying to yourself, B, what the hell? You've never reacted to something like this before. Well, there's, you know, first time for everything. Uh, I am a big fan of death battle. I'm a big fan of Screw Attack. Uh, death battle is the name of the episode. Screw Attack is the name of the outlet, the YouTube channel, the website, the company. And they actually reside here in Dallas, Texas as well. I've been a fan for many years. And what Screw Attack is to me is like one of the biggest geek outlets, you know, in the land besides like Comic Con or anything like that. And what they do is they take a ton of fictional characters, made up characters, um, and they analyze them, all their powers, all their abilities, their backstories. And then at the end of the video, they have them fight and they put fictional characters that will never meet uh, in the comic book or the fictional world. So. For example, you have Batman in DC, Spider-Man in Marvel. They will never fight each other, but in this series, they have them fight, and they really do do their homework. You know, they've uh, they've had Ryu from Street Fighter versus Jin uh, from Tekken. Uh, who else do they have? They have uh, you know Venom versus Bane, Iron Man versus Lex Luthor, Broly versus uh, uh, Doomsday, Batman versus Captain America. You know, Deadpool versus Deathstroke, Mario versus Sonic. I mean, the list goes on and on and on. Um, it, it's very entertaining. I am not into every episode they do. Uh, I think they had one where it was like Crash Bandicoot versus Spyro the Dragon. I didn't watch that one. But this one is Thanos versus Dark Sides, two of the biggest villains in all the comic book history. We had Thanos in Infinity War earlier this year, 2018. Um, and, of course, we also have Dark Side who can pretty much whoop superman or beat up the justice league and all that good stuff so i know i'm talking a lot and rambling but i had to give that explanation what i'm st where i'm starting this video is i think it's like 20 26 minutes long i'm starting this at the very beginning of the fight i'm not gonna make you sit here and watch you know the backstory for each character if you want to see the whole episode which i do suggest you watch if you're into these type of things there is a link down in the description box below but let me go ahead and put on these headphone guys i hope the animation is good with this one because sometimes they do like drawing animation 3d animation live action i'm I, they did one live action which it was like uh daredevil versus uh nightwing it was cool i wasn't that much a fan of it but i think the animation here is going to be great they put a lot of work in it, like I said, but I got on these headphones and now y'all can stop listening to me talk and watch me watch this episode. Here we go. You can fly, you can teleport, it'll send you through time and space and it's perfect for gaming. Cool. You follow me? <laughs> sure you do. You're a forward thinking guy. At last, and the Thanos, I don't know who I'm I'm gonna I'm give my money to Dark Side. Rocking that chin as always. Hmm, out the way. Get off my throne and kneel. Face death at the hand of your new emperor. You know not the infinite wealth of destruction. Oh, what is this? Alright. Dark Side is more of a badass to me, but we're gonna see. And I don't know if that apparently gun is going to work because it only works in the universe it's from, to my knowledge. But we'll see. You first. Oh wow. He just taking the hits too. <laughs> the dark side ain't no fun, man. Wow. Ate that one. I'm the king. I'm the king. Let's get it on. I'm here. Don't give me love. Just 
<laughs> Dark side still ain't even broke a sweat, man. Mega Bean. Wow. Dude, throwing planets for real. <laughs> Survive that? I am Thanos. Thanos is supreme. Thanos is God. Damn. How do you survive that? Really? I give up. Whoa. God, he can't do that. <laughs> still do it. The solar system at him. Then I still just like, come on. Uh. <sighs> These you games bet. bore me. Really? But this will bring a smile to my face. Huh. Should have did that a long time ago. It'll have to work. <laughs> Coward! Who are you? Who are you? I am entropy. I am death. I am dark side. Yeah, I don't think Thanos gonna win. This is who I am. <laughs> don't work, buddy. Is that the source wall? No reality is far from <laughs> Io. You have no power here. I am Thanos. I am all things. This is who I am. <laughs> Power up. Okay, oh. Is he looking at us? Oh my god, it's Deadpool with a gun! <laughs> Behold, in endless death. So, you watching any anime? K.O. Oh man, that's the worst way he could have gone out. Cause now he's gonna be dying over and over and over. Thanos was an incredible foe, especially while wielding the Infinity Gauntlet. Unfortunately, the gauntlet had a fatal flaw. Yeah, that golden glove only works in its own universe, and Darkseid could easily move the fight to new ones with his boomstick tubes. Universe hopping is kind of his thing. 
The Reed Richards of the Interdimensional Council of Reeds figured this out. Its three founding members, Reed, Reed, and Reed, each possessed Infinity Gauntlets, but discovered that they couldn't work outside of their own universes. The Gauntlet had no problem making Darkseid's avatar not feel so good, but since Darkseid's true form was always in the Fourth World universe, Thanos couldn't actually finish him off with the Gauntlet. Even if this fight took place in entirely neutral territory, the victor wouldn't change. Thanos' gauntlet wouldn't work, and True Darkseid's presence would actually just destroy everything just by being there. But he didn't just lose because of the gauntlet. He really couldn't keep up with the space golem. Even going toe-to-toe -to -toe with it being as fast as Silver Surfer was nothing compared to when Darkseid took a trip to the edge of existence. This puts Darkseid almost 28 octillion times faster than Thanos. And his Omega effect scales to the Astro Force, which could equal the Oblivion Bomb's universe-destroying blast. This means the Omega Effect and Infinity Gauntlet were both pretty even in terms of destructive ability. But unlike Thanos, Darkseid can use his Omega powers whenever and wherever he wants. Once he lost the Gauntlet, Thanos could certainly survive star-level attacks, and even greater. But Universal Destruction is definitely a bit more than his Purple Eternal Hide could handle. And even after that, Darkseid had plenty of ways to end the fight whenever he wanted, like the Omega Sanction. Thanos was super powerful, but Darkseid was just faster, stronger, and even more ruthless. Yeah. And if you think about it, Thanos needed the Infinity Gauntlet to become a god, but Darkseid already was one. Thanos yep. just couldn't run, run the gauntlet. Oh, you <laughs> son of a bitch! Uh, the winner is, is Darkseid. Dark side. Let's see what's next. Hey, thanks for watching this year's season finale. If you want the music from the battle, you can get it by clicking oh, the link this, below. Or if you guys finale, want to see so Thanos and Darkseid in a rap battle, then just click that video right over there and check out our friends JT Music. Death battle will return with the splash. Season 6 begins January 21st. I guess they're not going to tell us who um, comes next. All right. Well. I'm going to be honest with you guys. I love Screw Attack, and I know they put in a lot of work, but that was a bit disappointing. Um, they've done better as far as their battles are concerned and the choreography. Um, I've seen episodes where they're just much more creative. Um, I mean, there's been episodes of Dark Side, not Dark Side, but of a death battle that they've done that I've watched like 10 times, not back to back, but like, I think the one I watched the most was the Goku versus Superman. Um, I did watch Spider-Man vs. Batman a few times, Spider-Man vs. Captain America a few times, and also uh, Ryu vs. Jin. I watched that one as well. They even have, I'm looking right now, uh, Sub-Zero from Mortal Kombat vs. Glacier from Killer Instinct. Um, so, I mean, it was cool. I liked it. Um, I had a feeling that Darkseid was just going to win. Um, it just, if you just know the material and things like that, you know, Thanos is a bad, you know, mother effer. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but I have seen better episodes. I, I it kind of sucks to be honest with you that my first I've been watching these episodes for years, and my first time reacting to one of them on camera, I'm not just like, oh snap, that was cool, you know, like I usually do when I'm you know watching it on you know regular or whatever. But I mean, it was still uh, entertaining. Um, I if if that picks your interest at all, I suggest you go over and subscribe to their channel. Uh, they got like four or five million subscribers, and you know, show them some support tell them to give me a shout out uh, I'm, I'm just kidding um it was something else i was going to mention but um i don't really remember right now but that's okay but guys that is just my opinion for the thanos versus dark side death battle episode what did you think did you like it did you hate it did i turn you on did i turn you off do you agree with me or you disagree let me know down in the comment section below let's get this conversation going and keep it flowing if you like this video go ahead and give me that thumbs up if you don't that's fine but you can still subscribe to my channel you look me up on social media facebook instagram and twitter all that good stuff is right there at the bottom of your screen and i made it very easy by providing links to all that down in the description box below but guys i just want to thank you again for tuning in to my opinion slash review slash reaction for the thanos vs dark side death battle on screw attack and before you go don't forget that my name is brandon keith avery and that's just my opinion peace